How's it going? What's up? And what's happening? Bless your beautiful souls. Boom! Kiara Ducasse here today with the Crypto Bliss Show. Today I'm going to bring you a video that is going to blow your mind out the water once again because these cryptos that I keep showing you are going to make you uber wealthy in the bit in the near future. So if you guys are enjoying these videos that I'm posting for you, make sure to smash that thumbs up for me, please, on the video. Comment down below what your thoughts are on that particular project that I'm speaking about. And let's continue to build the community together wherever you can. Share the video with somebody that you know might be interested in that kind of content. So you guys know all about the Bybit link down below. And uh, yeah, that will give you a $30,000 deposit bonus. I am going to be making a lot of videos for you in the next few days. So make sure to smash a thumb, make sure to hit that notification bell so that you guys can see what's going to come up for you now because we're at a very, very, very strong tipping uh, point in crypto and at a pinnacle point. A lot of cryptos on the daily time frame on the RSI are reset or at the buying point and they're ready to go long. I'm going to show you one of them today uh, or in this video and let's go and have a look at which one that is. So and da, 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 da. let's go and talk about polka dot okay polka dot is currently sitting at five dollars 85 cents we're down four point uh point four percent for the day that's its beautiful logo very simple and elegant polka dot the name dot is the ticker and it's number 12 on coin mark uh, coin gecko with a 7.2 billion dollar market cap and a 7.6 million billion dollar um fully diluted valuation, maximum supply is infinite, but uh, yeah, so the total supply is 1.3 billion and in circulation is 1.22 billion. So amazing, check out this coin, boom, it's pumped like crazy. If you had bought it down here where it was back in 2020 and it pumped and you sold up here, you guys would have made some smasher cash. Right now it's sitting at those levels once again and I'm pretty sure you're gonna wanna be buying uh, you should have been DCA in pretty much all along this position. All time low was $2.70. We're up 117% from that. And it was $55 um, at the all time high, down 90% from that. The all time high market cap was up here. And the market cap at that point was 56 billion. Okay. So 56 billion right now kind of gives you an 8x from where we are. Yes, that will take you up to calculator. Let's get the calculator for you guys. Okay, so let's go. Uh, we said 56 billion. <whistles> Divided by 7176 billion. Did I put billion or trillion? I put trillion. My gosh, sorry. Okay, so 56, 65, 56,560,000,000, 5, 5, 56 billion. There you go. Divided by 7,176,000,000. Okay, there you go. Equals, yeah, there you go, an 8x. Okay, so 8 times 5.85 gives us a $45 price, which kind of takes us just under all time high. Okay, so that's very interesting, okay? Now, what you wanna go and, let's go and have a look quickly what Polkadot actually is. Polkadot is the multi-chain vision for Web3 and it starts here. So Polkadot, Polkadot unites and secures a growing ecosystem of specialized blockchains called parachains. Apps and services on Polkadot can secure, communicate across chains, Securely communicate across chains, forming the basis for a truly interoperable, decentralized Web3, okay, or Web. So, and that's why, so parachains are basically, so you have side chains, you have parachains, parachains run parallel with other chains, and they're pretty much the same um, on that. And then basically, a cross chain is where chains can um, trade between each other and there are there's multiple chains that you can use for different fees so if you go to binance and you want to withdraw ethereum you can withdraw ethereum and you can pay the gas fees of ethereum which are very expensive or uh, binance smart chain or tron or usdt etc so there's a number of different ways that you can use to pay gas fees and that's what that is so it's got true interoperability economic 
and transactional scalability. It's an easy blockchain that has been innovated, high energy efficiency, secure for everyone and user-driven governance. So you can learn more about Polkadot and Polkadot's technology. Come and read this for yourself. And I just like to give you guys the basis. You guys know that. I like to give you the basis. This is, it's like tasting the sweet and you actually just want to get more of that sweet. So yeah, powering the Polkadot network, the DOT token serves three distinct purposes, governance over the network, staking and bonding. So governance, okay, staking and bonding. So let's just have a look at what those are. Polkadot uh, token holders have complete control over the protocol. All privileges which are which on other platforms are exclusive to miners will be given to the relay chain participants, dot holders, including managing exceptional events such as protocol upgrades and fixes. Staking uh, holders to keep the network secure and collective rewards staking dot. Polkadot's advanced staking system is designed for maximum decentralization and fair representation, rewarding good actors and punishing bad actors to ensure internet security or network security. Bonding, new parachains are added by bonding tokens, outdated or non-useful parachains are removed by uh, by removing bonded tokens. This is form of proof of stake. So you can come here and check it out. You can learn to stake on DOT and it's founded by some of the blockchain's industry foremost builders, which is amazing. You can come check their blog and you can check their community out there across many, 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 many platforms, guys. But right now, I just wanna go and show you the chart, okay? And let's go and have a look at the chart on two different time, uh, two different levels. The first one is the long-term level of DOT and where we are right now. And then I'll have a look at the trading level for you. Okay, so uh, first one is currently we're down here. We're very oversold on the Stochastic RSI, uh, sorry, overbought on the Stochastic RSI and we're being resisted at this point. So that's basically, um, that's basically both the trend and the stochastic R RSI running parallel, which means that the pressure will come back down towards the downside. I don't know if we'll break the low of this low here at $4, okay? I don't think so, um, but if we do, that would still be a continue to be an excellent entry. And then you can see here, I've got three different levels of uh, take profits essentially for you when it starts to run. It's always good to take some profits, guys. Remember that. So this is into USDT, of course. Now on the weekly and the long-term time frame, if you bought down here and you bought a couple and you traded these coins all the way up to the 618 here and you took some profits, that would be the best place for you from a long-term strategy perspective. Take some profits. It might retrace back down to this kind of level here, the 17, 18 level, and then you can buy back in again. That's cool. but. The point is, is always to take profits and always remembering to take profits. So that's very beautiful on that time frame and on the daily time frame. And of course, we all know that the bigger time frames are the ones that count the most. But on the daily time frame, you can see that we've been sorry, guys, my back's a little bit. Um, on the on the daily time frame, we're looking to break. We're testing this a lot more now. This this upward or down sloping trend, and essentially. You can see how much we've pulled down and then literally gah, it's like we hit like we hit the bottom and we literally just full fell flat tested here didn't want to go down so this purple box is very very strong support um although the more times it knocks of course it wants to break so but we are still down here on the rsi and for me this is a really good intraday trade so on your daily and your four hourly and your 12 hourly, this would be a good trade to take probably back up to this position up here. Okay, so that would be a decent trade and that would give you a trade from where we are, boom, up to there of eight and a half percent. Okay, so 10X leverage is 85%, guys. So that would be very be a very beautiful trade. At the most, we could probably come back up to this level up here, which would obviously give us a little bit more percentage, but that was the outcome because of course, this is a downward slope and we could pump up here. So guys, if you enjoyed watching this video and you enjoyed seeing Polkadot and what we can do for long-term and short-term, then make sure to smash that thumbs up for me, like my channel, and please share the video wherever you possibly can with your friends and family, um, unless, unless you're having a hard time struggling with 
your family and your friends getting into crypto. Let me know if you are down below. I'd actually like to know if if people around you that you talk to crypto about are very open to it or, or are they very close to it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next one.